Hello, my name is Gavin Fritz, and I'll be teaching you how to drive a manual transmission car. Showcasing my own car, which is a manual transmission car, you automatically know the major difference with this setup. There are three pedals, rather than two in an automatic car, you got your gas and your brake pedal, but this third pedal, specifically for manual cars, it's known as the clutch. You press it down, it allows you to change gears in between while you're driving. One major thing to know about every single manual transmission car is that they have different speeds. Mine is a five speed. It goes one, two, three, four, five. Most notably, reverse is your other gear. When you're not in a gear, you're in neutral. Now that we covered the basics about driving a manual car, here's exactly how to start a manual car. Rather than it being an automatic car, you just turn the key you're not gonna get anywhere. So, for a manual car, you gotta press down on the clutch, then starts. Make sure your car is in neutral. If it's not in neutral, you will stall the car. The number one most important thing about driving a manual car is to make sure that you are timing correctly. If you do not time correctly, you will either A, stall the car. For example, if I just or to hit the clutch, go into gear, without even hitting the gas, I'll just stall. So I have to start the car back, make sure you're in neutral, which is the whole reason why you are in neutral when the car starts. In order to shift, you would go into neutral, go into gear, and as you're getting your foot off the clutch, right when your vehicle feels like it starts moving, then you put a little gas into it. And that should ensure that you get a smooth shift. Now that you know the basics of driving a manual, let's get going. Good job, you have successfully learned how to drive a manual transmission car. Now, for the last thing, I'll show you how to park your manual car. Want to make sure your car is not moving, make sure you engage the brake. Also, you want to engage the clutch as you'll most likely be in gear. Go into neutral, then you got the park brake. Make sure it's all the way up. Your car would definitely not move after that. Turn the car on put it into gear. Car's not going anywhere. It doesn't matter if you're uphill, downhill, nowhere. Just remember when you go and you start your car again, put it back into neutral so you don't stall out. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something new today.